these new wars are going to be fought differently. Absolutely. You know, the fact is there will be a lot of battles fought where there's not a gun fired. Mm-hmm. It's going to be through cyber mm-hmm. uh, and uh, so and through space. Mm-hmm. So we really have to, to prepare the, our infrastructure and our manpower for those future capabilities. It's going to be much more high tech, much more sophisticated. That's one of the reasons why last Congress I made uh, quality of life improvements, compensation, uh, education, housing, et cetera. Uh, my number one priority to, to boost it because, and we're going to have to continue in that realm because I envision a workforce in the Defense Department, meaning both military personnel and civilian, mm-hmm. to be much more high tech. Mm-hmm. And if we we're going to, to have that high tech employee, whether it's a service member or, or civilian, we got to compete with the private sector. Mm-hmm. But I, in order to do that, I think you're going to see the size of our military and our civilian personnel shrink but it'll be much higher paid and much higher caliber to 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 be able to fight these high-tech wars